Hackett and Racket as the Tennis Academy of Guam and the Guam National Tennis Federation present the U10 Tennis League. The summer season starts Saturday. You're looking at footage here from a youth tennis clinic recently held to help the uh, kids brush up on their tennis game. All right, interested players, register with league director Joe Cepeda before the start of the league summer season. That means you got just a couple days left here. Each registered player will be placed onto a team match play on a shortened 60-foot tennis court with red U tennis balls. Ah, that's so cute. To join the league or just ask about details, all right, or even private tennis lessons, call Cepeda at 988-7479 or email joe at tennisacademyguam.com. Double I, double AG, girls high school soccer. It was the Notre Dame Royals over the St. Paul Warriors, six to one behind a hat trick from Alicia Perez. That's three goals. Here's one of them right now. The kick, ground ball, goal! Right under the St. Paul's goalie. Hey, you gotta get low, girl. Uh, Notre Dame also got help from Brian Leon Guerrero and Mamis Blas and Destiny Castro here. Nice approach, the kick, it's good. Goal! As the Royals improved to 2-0 on the season. In other high school soccer games, Simon Sanchez 2-1 over Harvest behind two goals in the second half from Paige Uggen. And the Academy Geckos game was postponed and will be made up at a later date. Double I, double AG high school track and field results from the Ukudu track. Let's start with varsity women's 3,000 meters. Third place from Academy, Jessica Buckwalter with a 13 minute, uh, three second time. The second place, Janina Chris Piolo of the Islanders, 12 minutes, uh, 32 seconds. First place goes to Guam High, Alyssa Tatum. You see her here with Piolo as they were pretty close for most of the run. Now, just to give you an idea, the world record for women's 3,000 meters is eight minutes, six seconds. Varsity men's 110 meter hurdles, third place from Southern Michael Toposnia. A second place, Ukadus John Olandez. And first place, Johnny Kitagua of the JFK Islanders. Kitagua, of course, the hurdles stand out. Uh, left Island for competition with a few other Islanders, so good luck to them. On to Javelin now. Varsity men's fourth place, Juwan King of Guam High, 36.91 meters. Third place, Ian Valencia of the Sharks, 37.36 meters. Second place, Anthony Castro, also of the Sharks, 38.53 meters. And first place, Keith Charrett of Guam High, 38.59 meters. Wow, boys, I couldn't even throw my Zori that far. Now more double I, double AG results. Karen and Galaidi at Matapeng Beach. That's paddling for the Chamorro Impaired. Defending a girls champs, Guam High. The Panthers clocking the fastest times at three minutes, 22.7 seconds and three minutes, 23.3 seconds. In the 500 meter sprint, uh, the Lady Sharks finished second with a time of three minutes, 23.4 seconds. So it was definitely close. Islanders in third with three minutes, uh, 24.2 seconds. Over on the boys' side, defending champs, the JFK Islanders, first place, also in the 500-meter sprint, two minutes, 42.5 seconds. A full five seconds better than second place Sanchez, who clocked in at two minutes, 47.9 seconds, with the Bulldogs taking third with a 2.49 time. In the mixed division, Guam High took first, JFK second, and FD Academy third.